Morning. Um, I wanted to do another vlog, two in one week. Um, I've got lots of creative projects on the go at the moment and it kind of got me thinking about um, how we should all chase our dreams. And there are many things that kind of stop us from doing this sometimes. People um, kind of planting seeds in our head telling us that that's too ambitious or um, you couldn't possibly do that because there are thousands of other people wanting to do that. And I kind of just want to want to reiterate today that your dreams are your dreams and you should follow them come hell or high water. Um, there, was, there was somebody that I used to work for in um, a dance company that said to me, come, come to me with your wish list. The things that you really want to do and what I'll do is I'll try and um, accomplish at least some of those wishes and I think that aiming high for your dreams is um, very very important to kind of fulfilling your dreams. Um, I wanted to do a major project about five years ago with um, um, a group of community um, dancers and I went to see someone in a meeting and, and they basically turned around to me. This is this is me who's been working in the industry for over 20, 30 years now. Um, and they, he turned to me and he said, I think you should start small. And I kind of thought, well, I've been doing small for the last 30 years. And the thing that I really want to do is I want to engage as many people as possible in this project. I want to direct it. I want to choreograph it. I want to do the lighting design. I want to... Um, collate all the music, I want to do the filmmaking, I want to do absolutely everything in this project because I think that I'm ready for it and he kind of said well you know I, I'm, I can't really help you because I think that you, sh I think it would be sensible of you to start small. So anyway, me being me, thought <laughs> I'm, I'm going to do this and um, it was the first project I did, um, a large scale community project about six years ago and I had 80 dancers and I went out and I got all of the all of the schools that I needed to be involved I had an adult dance group um, and you know what I achieved that and I and I did it to the best of my ability and I succeeded so even when someone who was quite high up um, in the dance world turned to me and, and said oh I have doubts about this maybe you should start small I thought that was a that was the kick up the bum I needed to go, actually, you're saying I can't do this, so I'm going to do it. And you know what, in for the last six years I've done those projects and I've directed them and I've choreographed them and I've done the lighting design and I've done everything that needs to be done to make that that project a success. I haven't even gone for Arts Council funding. I've managed to fund these projects myself because I feel so passionately about it. So then the next thing is, what do you do? How, well, you know, you've, you've, you've completed this task for yourself. You've ticked off that box on your list of um, dreams that you want to do. Where's the next step? And I think the, ne the, the next step for me is to think even bigger than that um, and, and, ch and to challenge myself. And I think dreams are about challenging yourself. And don't get me wrong, dreams are hard work. If anything comes for free, then it's not really worth having. If you really have to work hard at something, then you have really accomplished something. So if you want to climb a mountain, you can't just climb a mountain. You really have to put the effort in and you have to be determined to do that thing. And so I think that what I'm saying today is that if you have a dream, no matter who says you can't, you make sure you find every opportunity to fulfill that dream, to be the best you can be, so that when you come to the end of your days, you can say, yeah, I did the best, and I achieved everything I wanted to achieve, because at least you're trying, and at least you're getting things done, and that has to be complete fulfillment. Peace out, people.